said that you no. said you were going to put me on the block. Yeah, and now I give you I the reason not, why. And wait. now I give you the reason why. Okay, Didn't I? and then okay. also added, but see, this one I forgot. It's so easily persuaded. Why are you even thinking that if you're working with me? If <laughs> you should not be working with someone that you think is so easily persuaded, okay. Raul. And you say stupid comments like this mm -hmm. all the time. Okay. Which makes me question okay. you and your loyalty to me. I have 100% loyalty <laughs> you know if, to you. If, you know if what Kelsey, I did last week wasn't towards no. you personally. It was crack my own ass because Maddie said I know, but your ass is you grass, saying which you've been saying all I know, week. But you know how you and said you can't, that it's a group decision all yeah. the time? That wasn't a group decision. That was your own decision. And you keeping Dallas was your own decision. No, that was a group decision. What that group was decision? my decision. Your Jared group decision Mitch with decision. the Blue Room, with your group decision to put me and the brothers up on the block if you guys were to win we each to week. To that was out. a group decision that, that you had made last week. So no. don't argue with me with that, or I will get the whole house down there right now, and I will ask everyone down there. Okay. Okay. So unless you want to get Jared and Kelsey up here, I'm done with this conversation. I told you I'm with you 120%. If you think I'm so easily persuaded, mm -hmm. then don't. Then you obviously don't have 100% trust in me. I have, you don't have the same trust in me that I... I have 90% on you. Okay, and that's not, a, that's not good enough. No. We need to have 100% trust within all four of us. <laughs> okay. No, no, it's true. You do. It's true. So Raul just <laughs> told me he has 90% trust in me, not 100% trust, and then I'm very Why easily you persuaded. The, ugh, HOH. No, I'm not It's getting hot in there. Oh, my God. Those are so fucking she cute. She just told me what... what Mitch was saying. Oh, he was him. saying that the probability and the statistics prove that if... <laughs> I knew that's what no, it was going to be. No, but... I'm with you guys 100%. I'm voting Mitch out. So was He <sighs> came in here wanting to know what Mitch was saying. So I said what Mitch was saying, and I also said that he was trying to discrim or incriminate every single yeah. thing about So Mitch told him that I was no. going to put the brothers and Cassandra up. What he said... Oh my God. What he said to me was... I'm with you guys. I'm voting Mitch out. Let's just start with that so you guys don't think I'm being shady no, 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 she's or not I'm being, being wishy-washy because... She's not being shady. She's not being wishy-washy. Well, no, you trust me 90%, so you do think I'm being a little bit shady. Don't <laughs> fuck with me. Because of what happened last week. You should week. ask him what the probability of a group of five looks like. <laughs> okay, wait. Listen to this, Kelsey. What? Because Raul also gave me information that you were telling him and Jared. Yes. That you saw on the TV, me talking to Dallas and saying, we need to put Raul and Jared up. I didn't Raul. say or we need to put Raul. I said, Raul, you, your name keeps, like, your mouth keeps saying and Raul and Jared. And I didn't hear anything. I she just saw you yeah. with Dallas a lot. And mouthing but we Raul already, and Jared, Raul and Jared? I don't know for sure, but right. I, like I said, I'm like, I could see mouthing, and I could see Dallas saying Raul and Jared, Raul you and see Jared. Me I honestly, like, couldn't, I don't know what you guys were saying. Okay. I just saw, I just saw you with Dallas a lot. Anyways. Mitch was just came up here, was telling the probability stuff, whatever math. I don't really get it. But the one thing, and I'm I'm telling, I'm starting this conversation as I am voting Mitch out. I am with you guys. Well, I trust you 100. percent I trust Jared 100. percent As until right now, I trusted you 100. percent Until you just said all this crap. It's because you did this same conversation with me last time, and you ended up voting to keep Dallas. Well, in. that was a different story. And it happened three times, like it was in a one group hour. Thing. Well, then don't work with me. No, I'm Do not saying not I'm not going to work with, work with you. I'm not saying I'm not going to no, work well, with you. No, that's what you are don't saying. Get all, don't get all... No, because I'm not going to put up with his crap. It's what I'm saying not is... not crap, but it's just I'm telling you what you did last week and you're doing it. Mitch, I mean, like, whatever the fuck I'm scared that you do it is, today again. You're going in circles with me, and I'm telling you, we've gone through this. We're not going to see eye to eye. Last week, it was a group decision. One person on the block was going after these two people. One person on the block was going after these two people. I had to save my own ass because she was saying my ass is grass. Okay? That's why I voted her out. And even if I did say, oh, yes, I am voting Dallas out after that speech, I would have voted her out. Well, and Thank last you. week, it was last week. Last week is last this week. week. Moving is this forward, week. no, but moving forward, we are together 100%. So when you come in here and say, I only trust you 90%, see, this is what I was worried about. You're so you, easily persuaded. You do just You do not talk to someone in your alliance and say that you are so easily persuaded because I don't want to work with someone that thinks that of me and that only trusts me 90%. You just when I had my 100% trust in you and I'm just telling you what you asked me. You just need to understand they were just weary of last week. No, I know and that, but at the end of this think week, of when good... I'm with you guys, how could you dare say that you don't trust me 100%? <laughs> but they trust you, that's why I trust you, Cassandra. But you're saying you only trust me 90%. He, they are you so to that's be fine. They are Anyways, just wary. another thing that I'm going to tell you what Mitch was telling me was that at the end of last week, there was a group blue room kind of alliance made between him, 
Jared. I heard it wasn't Alliance. I heard it was or the it wasn't okay, Alliance. Ramsey, it was a decision. Maddie. Maddie. Okay, decision, whatever. Be Ramsey, talk, Maddie. I knew that you were talking to Ramsey. I, I told you. And don't I know, talk. I don't talk to her. I don't give that information. And Mitch, I say all the time, that, don't say anything no matter Ramsey. what, no, no matter Alliance where I voted, no matter where, and I could go ask them again that. with you. You guys are talking at the same time. No matter where I voted, that the, their group blue decision would put this week, if any of them won HOH, it would be me and the brothers up on the block. Who said that? Mitch. Mitch, Maddie, Ramsey. Mitch said that. Maddie, Ramsey, Nikki, all of them said there was a blue room decision. Jared and Raul said that? No, they weren't in here. Oh, Listen probably, to the conversation. When probably, you were in this meeting with Mitch, with all of us, Mitch, Maddie, Ramsey were all saying that there was a blue room decision at the end of the week last week before the vote. Between him, Jared, Ramsey, Maddie, Mitch, saying that no matter where you? I voted, that if any of them won HOH this week, that it would be me and the brothers up on the block. So I, well, I know Mitch is just saying shit. They could be saying shit. But working with you guys, I trust you guys 100%. I'm, you're my people. I'm moving forward with you in this game till the end. It's I trust you 100%. I trust Jared 100%. I trust him 100%. So when he comes in, when he comes in here and asks me, "Oh, what does Mitch say?" Obviously, I'm going to tell you everything he said. And then I told him this little tidbit of info of he also said at the end of last week, blah blah blah. You guys want to put me up? So was that true? And you were like, "Whatever you just said." I told you that I thought of it, and I had to tell him that I was going to put you up. Otherwise, he wouldn't. He, I, could, I didn't want to. The thing is, I wanted to write to him, so when he comes to him... Who were you lying like, to? ...to Mitch and tell him that I was going to put you up. I told him even in my washroom But DHH. why last week? I thought you guys were working together no, last, last week. week. I thought like you and me were working week together. Before, when I won my HOH, the next morning. That is ah. the thing about last week, is that you guys were on separate pages. And you know what? We need to look at that now, mm -hmm. moving forward, right. as a good thing. Right. Because you and the brothers went and did your own thing last week, and it made it look like but you same, were going But we could say that about him and Jared. But the you is, know that they could not have kept Dallas. You know that. Like, we could take out fucking Maddie. Yeah, but moving forward, us four are working together. You, you, me, It's because we are, no. That's the thing, but you know I that. know, but when I tell you all this stuff, and I'm just asking you, was that true? Because I'm working with you. And I, I just said that you asked it true because it was just supposed to. And but no, your first was response was, see, this is what I was worried about. You're so easily persuaded. Exactly. Why is because that now I'm you're with freaking out about, about something me. that I said yes to. I told you that yes, we thought of it because you guys, you guys, have to, you guys are going to have to get over this. I'm just going in circles with you. I don't honestly don't want to talk to you right now, Raul. But look, 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 look. Because you're going in circles look, with look, me. Look, you look, don't see where anyone else is coming from. I see where you come from. Steve, you did the same thing to me last week. Exactly. Exactly the words that you used in this last week. I'm not going to work with someone that thinks that of me. Guys, guys, you guys, you guys. You guys had a disagreement last week because you really wanted one thing, you really wanted another thing, you guys couldn't agree, and so you disagreed, and so you had that moment. That right. moment is past. It's a really good thing Dallas didn't stay in this house or else I probably wouldn't be here right now, and then this wouldn't be happening. LaVita would be here. But talking to you is going in circles. You are never going to see where I'm coming from. <laughs> that is the because thing. That is right. It's because no, we're because so similar. That That's why you bothers me, because we are so Because you made so that started. dumb comment about oh you're so my easily God. persuaded. I'm not working with someone that thinks that. You That's guys, why don't you just get over it? You guys said, this, you guys said your shit. You said it. Now you're talking in circles. Let's bygones be bygones. We made a mistake. We've made some dumb mistakes. People have said dumb things. We are now here and we're moving forward. And we need to focus on this week. Last week happened. You guys didn't, didn't yeah, agree. No. Shit happened. Whatever. You thought that he was getting you out. You thought that she was getting you out. Fucking no, squash that, it. No, that wasn't it. I never thought that he was coming after me. I really didn't. At the end of last week, I said to you, you know, I'm not coming after you. I just need you to understand that I'm scared. You need to understand when votes are split like that. I just, that's just what I want you to understand. Like, that's so it. why wouldn't you go after me? And I totally Maddie agree with you with what you want. I just need you to understand that that scared me. 